Hundreds of Russian military gathered in open area and became easy targets for ATA CMS. The village of Kuban in the Luhansk region is located about 100 kilometers from the front line that is outside the range of most Ukrainian anti-personnel weapons as previously thought. This is reported by Forbes. This is a possible explanation for why last Wednesday potentially hundreds of Russian military personnel gathered in an open area. The US made ATA CMS high precision ballistic missiles with a range of up to 300 kilometers disperses up to a thousand small submissions. The Russians were walking around the field in broad daylight and a Ukrainian drone spotted them from a height after which four two-ton ATA CMS flew in. According to journalists, one missile did not explode and the other three scattered deadly small grenades. One ATA CMS missile exploded right above a crowd of about 116 Russians. According to the Institute for the Study of War, all Russians could have died in the reign of submissions. Wednesday's strike may have been one of the deadliest in a full-scale war, indicating poor planning by the Russian command. The command of the Russian armed forces could have known that such a strike was likely because the supply of ATA CMS was one of the main military priorities of Ukraine in recent months. According to journalists, the Russians knew that Ukraine could strike ATA CMS and were warned in advance that the Ukrainian forces would attack the most vulnerable concentrations of Russian forces, including training grounds. The authors of the publication recalled that when last autumn Ukraine received its first small batch of ATA CMS, they were immediately launched at several Russian airfields. About 20 helicopters were damaged or destroyed. Subsequently, in early April, Ukrainian crews shelled a valuable S-400 air defense system of the Russian Air Force. About four launchers were destroyed. At least six people have been shot at an apartment complex in Fort Worth, Texas, police reported. The ages of the victims range from 3 to 19. The incident took place on Wednesday evening at an apartment complex in the 3000 block of Las Vegas Trail in the western part of the city. According to the Fort Worth Police Department early Thursday morning, a total of six victims received injuries ranging from minor to severe. Police received a call about a reported shooting at an apartment complex at around 7.30 p.m., when they arrived at approximately 7.38 p.m., officers located several victims with gunshot wounds outside in the parking lot, police said. Five of the victims were hospitalized while one refused treatment for their injury, the police said, adding that the conditions of the five who were taken in for medical care are currently unknown. Making a statement regarding the shooting incident, the authority said that the Fort Worth Police Department can confirm that a suspect vehicle was observed driving by this location and at least one or more individuals shot from the suspect vehicle toward all of the victims at the location. The investigation into the shooting remains open and officers are gathering information and attempting to locate the suspect vehicle and suspect or suspects.